Yeah. Hey guys, how's it going? Hi, Hi Nav. Hi Nav. Welcome to Dixie Ford. How are you guys? I'm, I'm Scott. Scott and yes. 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 Okay, what vehicle are you guys looking for today? We're actually looking for a small car for just the two of us. Okay. We've got a dog, but uh, um, yeah, I've heard good things about Ford, so I thought we'd check out what you have. Excellent, excellent. So since you guys are in the market for a small sedan or hatchback, uh, my recommendation would definitely be the 2015 Ford Focus SE. Uh, I've got a nice one here in the showroom. Let me show you guys a few points of uh, the new uh, Focus. So for 2015, they redesigned the Focus. Last year had a different body style, um, but this year they went with a little bit more of a stylish look. Uh, the vehicle looks like it's really in motion with the way the hatch curves over and the sleek lines along the body of the vehicle. Um, if you guys notice along the front of the grille, Ford really went with their one look on the 2015 Focus. So you notice the hexagonal grille that you might find on some of the other trims or some of the other vehicles. Um, now, do you guys do a lot of highway driving or a lot of city driving? You guys got the dog and you know, maybe go up to the cottage and stuff like that? Yeah, on the weekends, but mainly, you know, during the week, it's, uh, we're going to use it to go back and forth to work, things like that. Okay, okay. So, since you guys do quite a bit of driving, the good thing is that uh, the 2015 Focus comes standard with a 2 liter naturally aspirated engine. It's a 4 cylinder engine, so let me pop the hood, show you guys what we need here. Um, so, in terms of fuel efficiency, there's definitely a lot of fuel saving technology in the vehicle. First of all, along the front of the grill, there's active grill shutters, which are small shutters that automatically open and close to improve your aerodynamics and fuel efficiency. So Scott, when you're driving on the highway going up to the cottage, the shutters are going to close to reduce the wind drag, and when you're driving in the city, they'll open to improve the cooling of the engine. Um, pretty impressive. Not bad. <laughs> not bad. And going along with the fuel saving technology, the vehicle also uses gasoline direct injection. So what that basically means is the gas, a precise amount of fuel is getting sprayed directly into the cylinder to provide you with optimum power and optimum fuel efficiency. Um, now, this one also has a new power shift, DPS power shift transmission in focus. It's a six speed automatic and it's actually had quite a few refinements for this year. Um, the way the transmission is designed is it's basically two separate transmissions that are mounted side by side with gears 1, 3, and 5 on the one side and 2, 4, and 6 on the other side. It shifts electronically, so there's no torque converter in the vehicle, which reduces the weight to, again, improve your fuel efficiency. One tip that I always like to give my customers when driving the Focus with this power shift transmission is to make sure that you give a precise amount of acceleration on, on the gas pedal to allow the transmission to shift smoothly. Um, some more styling and design features are a nice wrap around headlights, give the vehicle a little bit of that European style. Uh, style of flare. If you guys want to come over on this side here, um, I'll also show you guys that 16 inch alloy wheels are now standard on the SE models, with, uh, opposed to the steel wheels which you might have found last year. So just going for a nicer, more refined look on the focus. These uh, side mirrors will fold uh, in and out. Um, so in case you're backing up into a tight spot, you don't really have to worry about um, your mirror cap breaking off. I know it costs a fee. <laughs> you got to be careful when you're backing up, but at least um, you have the uh, fold-out mirrors. There's also the blind spot mirror fully integrated into the side mirror, which is a Ford exclusive. Um, this blind spot mirror definitely helps out with your visibility of the road. In fact, I know for some ladies, when you're driving the vehicle, you want to make sure that you can see everything that's around you well. So uh, the Focus also comes standard with the backup camera. So regardless of if you go for a basic S model or a fully loaded uh, titanium, you'll have a clear path view of what's behind. Um, if you guys take a look inside the vehicle, try and have a seat. What do you guys try? And... Notice how easy it is to get into the vehicle, and it's a very comfortable seat. They really hug you on the sides and everything like that. Um, in terms of the technology, uh, definitely some great technology in the vehicle. And like I said, backup camera is standard. Um, and Bluetooth is also standard. So the sync system, Scott, you'll find on all of the trim levels. Uh, like I said, from the S all the way up to the SE. So you don't have to worry about your wife talking on the phone while she's driving along. You don't have to worry about no expensive ticket. That's good, right? Yeah, absolutely. Um, and it's voice activated phone. Right? Now, um, 
Another very important factor, which I'm sure you guys are uh, going to be concerned about, is safe. Right. So, um, in terms of safety improvements to the the Focus, um, some safety features that it has are reinforced steel all along the sides of the B pillar to protect against a side impact. A reinforced B pillar and. Um, um, crumple zones inside the engine, which will, in case of a front end collision, they will basically compress rather than coming into the passenger cabin. Key safety features are the SOS post crash alert system. So, in case you get into an accident, the vehicle will automatically uh, activate the four way flasher, sound the horn, and unlock the doors for you. So, you know, in case you're unconscious or something like that, the, the doors automatically unlock. Right. Uh, it also has 911 assist, so if your phone is properly paired to the Bluetooth system through the sync connectivity, the vehicle will automatically call 911 for you. Oh, that's a great feature. Great feature, definitely. Um, now, let me go back into the, the back here, seat. Hey? So, uh, you guys mentioned that you guys have a dog too, right? Yes. So, um, rather than the dog, you know, kind of running around back here, the good thing is that the rear seats in the back here, they fold completely flat. So, I'll show you guys how they go down. Pretty simple, just one, two, and the seats down. Oh. Uh, it's a 60-40 split, so you can, you guys can put both seats down, have the dog uh, freely roaming around in the back seat there. Um, along the side to the hatch. Uh, rear wiper blade is standard now, and like I had mentioned before, your backup camera is right here. Pop the hatch and show you guys a little bit of the space here. Like I said, it's a 60-40 split, so you guys definitely have a lot of room for the dog, or you know, even if you have to take a lot of luggage up to the cottage or anything like that. Um, your spare tire is underneath here. So it's a mini spare and uh, all the tools for the spare are underneath there. You'll also notice a funnel. Now the reason for the funnel is because it's a really great feature that all four vehicles have is the capless fuel system. So if you notice back here, there's no gas cap. Scott, have you ever had gas stolen out of your vehicle? Uh, yes. Yeah, huh? Uh -huh. That sucks, right? Yeah, you got into your car, you start it up, you just filled it up and it's empty. It the good thing about the capless fuel system here is that nobody can steal your gas. They won't be able to get into the gas nozzle here. The only thing that can actually fit in there is the gas nozzle or the funnel. So in case you run out of fuel, you stick in the funnel and then you use the red jerry can. Um, the benefits of having the capless fuel system are, first of all, like I said, nobody can steal your gas. Uh, it's safer for the environment because no fumes are getting out. And I know on some manufacturers, uh, if you don't tighten your gas cap properly, you'll get an engine light. Here, you don't have to worry about it. So definitely a, a great feature to have, and like I said, it's, a, it's on all of four vehicles. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the walk around for the 2015 Focus. Uh, it's definitely a very safe, fun, reliable vehicle, and you're going to get great fuel economy. So how about I get the keys for this one, we'll take it for a drive, and we can write this fuel up. What do you think, uh, honey? Sure. All right, guys. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Sam. Thank you.